this is what I get in return for 30 years of service for my company, and they send some yo-yo like you in here to try to tell me that I'm out of a job, they should be telling you you're out of a job. You have a lot of gall coming in here and firing your number one producer, and then you're going to go home tomorrow and make more money than you've ever made in your life, and I'm going to go home without a paycheck. Fuck you. I, I just, I guess you leave me dumbfounded. I don't, I don't know where this is coming from. How am I supposed to go back as a man and explain this to my wife that I lost my job? On the stress level, I've heard that losing your job is like a death in the family. But personally, I feel more like the people I worked with were my family and I died. I can't afford to be unemployed. I have a house payment, I have children. I don't know how you can live with yourself, but I'm sure that you'll find a way while the rest of us are suffering. Who the fuck are you, man? Excellent question. Who the fuck am I? Poor Steve has worked here for seven years. He's never had a meeting with me before, or passed me in the hall, or told me a story in the break room. And that's because I don't work here. I work for another company that lends me out to pussies like Steve's boss, who don't have the balls to sack their own employees. And in some cases, for good reason. Because people do crazy shit when they get fired. <laughs> Did, did, did I do something wrong? I mean, is there something I can do differently here? This is not an assessment of your productivity. I'm gonna try not to take this personal. <sighs> do personal. Steven, I want you to review this pack. Take it seriously. I think you're gonna find a lot of good answers in here. I'm sure this is gonna be very helpful. A packet. Thank you. Um, packet. <sighs> <clears throat> Anybody who ever built an empire or changed the world said where you are right now. And it's because they sat there they were able to do it. That's the truth. I'm gonna need your key card. Great. Okay. Now, would you take the day, go get together your personal things, and then tomorrow, you. Get yourself some exercise. You go out for a jog, you give yourself some routines, and pretty soon you find your legs. How do I get in touch with you? Don't worry, we'll be in touch with you soon. This is just the beginning. I'll never see Steve again. to fly with me. This is where I live. When I run my card, the system automatically prompts the desk clerk to greet me with this exact statement. Pleasure to see you again, Mr. Bingham. It's these kinds of systemized, friendly touches that keep my world in orbit. probably hate about traveling, the recycled air, the artificial lighting, the digital juice dispensers, the cheap sushi, are warm reminders that I'm home. 